Yo, what's going on everybody? It is Tristan and today in this video what we're going to be diving into is we're going to be diving into discussing the Travis Scott Canary Yellow Jordan 1 which as you all can see is a pretty nice pair in hand but there are some details on these that I want to discuss that actually are a little bit different when they meet the eye. They may not look uh, quite the same as you know early photos. That's one of the main things I want to say is that there's a couple details that are a little bit different in hand. Uh, so that's basically what we're going to be diving into and of course discussing the full sneaker you know everything else it comes with the extra laces so we're going to get into that right now if y'all want more content like this feel free to subscribe and like down below which is trying to 200 likes on this video that'd mean a lot if you could do that and of course do not forget you guys can check out my instagrams down below i'm doing a military blue giveaway there right now so just go to my most recent reel and get entered the instructions are very very simple so don't miss out on your chance to win a free pair of just stay following on the page there and i'm selling stuff in my stories so you can hit me up if you're interested in anything there as well on my ig but that's it. I hope y'all will enjoy. You can let me know your thoughts on these down below once you know get a little bit into it or you can comment right now. And yeah, let's just get started. So first things first, as you guys can see, this is the Canary Yellow Travis Scott Jordan 1 Low. So first things first, as you guys can see when it comes to these, we got kind of this nice uh, blue swoosh. Stands out. Definitely one of the main things I will say. This stands out on the sneaker. And then we got uh, kind of this yellow suede material. Now, one of the main things I will say um, about this yellow suede material, I'm actually going to get up to show you guys this. So as you guys can see with this sneaker um here we go i'm gonna let this focus so one of the main points i want to uh kind of get into right here so this yellow suede is not as bright as you would think in hand it's bright but as you guys can see the tongue tag is actually a slightly brighter yellow the, the tongue tag yellow more or less matches what we got on the inside of the sneaker here maybe y'all can see that but the yellow suede is a little bit darker in hand and also this uh you know leather material that we got in the toe box and also by the center of the sneaker on both sides is actually more of a gray maybe you can notice that right now it hits a little bit more gray uh in person now is it fully gray no it's actually you can it's more or less kind of that uh white leather colorway and that's how you know the blue swoosh is hitting off that nicely how the yellow uh you know hits off it nicely as well but you can also if you get like a really close glimpse you may notice it's like a little bit gray right there like as it fades into the yellow like you can tell it's just gray so that's one of the main things i want to point out uh right off the bat it has a little bit of a gray tint on the leather material but everything else is yellow and blue other than uh some other portions on the sneaker which i will show you guys right now so another thing i want to get into with these why don't i go ahead and show y'all we got the heel portion back here by the sneaker as you guys can see we got the air jordan logo and we got the cactus jack uh, logo right there as well we got some soles on these as well kind of uh these i don't know why like the colorway that they chose to use uh it reminds me of like a, a baseball pitch so yeah that just you know that's what we got reminds me of a baseball field i don't know why it just reminds me of i guess like the dirt or something but that's what we got going on uh on the soles right here just another thing to point out and show to you guys and then of course you got the nike logo uh in the center right there nothing out of the ordinary here so that's another thing i can show you guys uh, then also, of course, we can dive into some details on the tongue tag. So, of course, we got the Nike Air uh, logo right there. Then you flip to uh, this. You got the Cactus Jack logo. Y'all can notice that. And again, you can see that yellow is a bit brighter than the yellow that we have on the outside of the sneaker. One of the main things I want to point out. Now, another thing uh, about the sneakers. As you guys can see, these come with red and blue laces. You may have seen these on some of the early photos. They do come with these red and blue laces. So you can swap that out. I actually think these with the blue laces would look really, really good. So personally, uh, your boy might be looking uh, for a pair of these very, very soon, or I'll just, you know, might grab a pair uh, early and uh, swap them out with like the, you know, red laces or blue laces. I think that would be sick. But overall, the market is really strong for these right now. Uh, I mean, I've seen them selling at like 1600 bucks at the moment, which is pretty crazy. Uh, if anybody's interested in some sizes, let me know and I will try and find them. Uh, you know, just at the moment, I've, I've sold out of any pairs that I've had of these, but also, um, you know it's just a really cool pair it's one of the main things i want to mention aside from you know the prices on them it's actually just a nice personal i like how these travises look it's one of the main things uh and also on the inside of the sneaker i'll show you all the insoles in the second as well but here uh we also got that cactus jack logo right there so hopefully y'all can notice that and again that yellow suede which again it's not as bright as that tongue tag yellow, but still pretty bright. You'll definitely notice it. It's actually a really nice colorway in hand. I, I, I like it. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's not um, it's not too much. That's actually one of the main things I'll mention. It's not too much. It's actually nice uh, for a Travis Scott low. And here is uh, the Jumpman logo on the inside of the sneaker. We just got that red uh, Jordan uh, Jumpman. And you all can see the laces there as well. 
And then also on this one, y'all can see just that typical uh, on Travis Lowe's. We'll see this where, you know, it just runs runs down the sneaker and says Travis Scott like that. So that's what we got, uh, you know, on the insole of these, just so y'all uh, can see that. And then on this tongue tag as well, you know, we got the Cactus Jack Nike Air combo. Very, very common uh, to see that uh, on these Travis Lowe's. But that's what I can really show you guys right now um, about the Canaries. So keep in mind, these are going for a thousand plus right now. I don't think that's a shocker. Any Travis sneaker early is going to go for a lot of money, but these don't drop next month. This is going to be set for summer 2024. We actually don't have a date yet. My prediction personally, I'm going to go with May or June just, you know, for this sneaker right here. I think that's probably when they would schedule this release for. I don't think they'll wait all the way till August. I know we see a lot of Travis Lowe's in August, so maybe we'll see these ones too then, but that's really what I can point out about these at the moment, guys. These are fly. So if anybody's interested in anything, just let me know on my Insta. I'll try uh, and get you guys right, but at the moment, uh, your boy doesn't have any left. These sold fast. That's one of the main things I'll say. Like, these, these definitely have some demand. Uh, it may be hidden demand, but I don't think it's so hidden. You know, Travis Lowe's, people are just kind of following that hype right now. Nike's just going to continue to make more and more. And here uh, is that uh, toe box leather. This is another great thing I want to show you guys. The leather on that toe box. Look how, like, pebbled and, like, soft this leather is. Like, that is a really, really nice material. So that's one of the main things I want to point out about this sneaker is that it's just a nice material throughout the whole entire thing. Uh, and they did these really well. So shout out to Nike. I really like uh, what you guys did here. There we go on the back heel portion of the sneaker uh, as well. And yeah, everything else that we got going on around that leather is really, really soft. It's one of the main things I mentioned. It's a very, very soft leather material. So, I mean, you just, you, you notice that in hand. That's a, that's one of the main things I'll say. So aside from that, looks like a pretty comfy sneaker. Uh, overall, not a bad colorway. Definitely one that's pretty uh, wearable, I would say. Like, you know, you wouldn't really have too many problems wearing these. If you're someone that likes bright colors, obviously, if you're someone that, you know, normally isn't wearing, like, bright colors, then these might be a little bit uh, out there for you, but I think it's cool regardless. Like, the, the, this is something... Uh, you know, again, we've had a lot of Travis Lowe's, but this is definitely a little bit different. So I like that they're spicing it up a bit, you know, adding some yellow, you know, some different colors they normally wouldn't try. It's pretty cool. They're going back to, you know, Travis Scott's high school colorways also. I think, I think it's a nice touch. So that's what I can mention about the Canary Lowe's that we got right here. Keep in mind, these are dropping in women's sizes, but they are going to be extending the stock, uh, excuse me, extending the size range like they did with the olives. So it's going to go up to like, you know, 14 or 15 W. So my big feet people are still going to be able to eat. It's just going to be very hard to get those sizes. So keep that in mind. They are going to be producing big sizes for these. This this one actually right here is a 12 and a half W, so 11 men's. Uh, already gone. Like again, these these went quick. But uh, yeah, that's what I can say uh, about these canary yellow Travis Lowe's. Keep in mind they'll be extending the sizes. Here's some of you know the details in hand. Tongue tag yellow is a bit brighter than the yellow on the outside of the sneaker. We've got the portion back here by the heel. Here are the soles. And don't forget the extra laces that they come with as well, the red and blue ones. So that is what I can mention to you guys about the Canary Yellow, Travis Scott Lowe's. Man, these these are cool. These are cool. That's one of the main things I want to say. Like, I normally don't like Travis Lowe's, but I think these ones are nice. It's a nice touch. It's a little bit different. Um, yeah, why not? Like, and the main thing I'm saying when it's a little bit different is the colorway. We haven't seen this before. Obviously, they're not going to drop the exact same colorway as they did before, but they've gotten damn close with some of these olive colorways. Like some of these are almost the exact same. So we got some a little bit different different here. I'm rocking with it. So that's what I can say about the Canaries. Let me know your thoughts on these down below. Do you all think this is an overrated sneaker at the moment? I would not disagree with you if you said that. Or do you think it's one that, hey, you know, these actually might be worth the cop. I'm going to be going for these drop days. So let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget you guys can subscribe and like for more early reviews just like this. I'm always trying to bring you guys the best content I can. So just let me know in the comments if you guys want to see. Whoa, almost dropped those. Not want to do that. Very, very expensive sneaker. So yeah, just uh, let me know again your thoughts on these down below and uh, do not forget to check out my instagram too to get entered for that military blue giveaway uh or if you're interested in buying selling trading with me i'm always uh you know buying pairs as well um and yeah always selling you can just check my story i'll post some more there today for sure but uh boys got some homework to get done so i'm gonna go and make sure to get that done right now and uh yeah just let me know your thoughts on the canaries i love these like again it's a bit different so i'm rocking with it but that's it t thank you guys and hopefully i'll catch you on the next video soon Peace.